Back well, this week on Montana Cares, MTN's Matt Holzaffel brings us to one of the country's premier hubs for Western art. They may have lost part of their busy season due to the pandemic, but you don't want to miss what they have in store. So far on Montana Cares, we've covered a video game company started by two brothers in their own house, a family-owned ranch, and the most fun you can have on wheels without being in a car. But this week, we're at a place so rich in history and so rich in culture, you have to see it to believe it. We're in our 67th year here uh, in Great Falls as an institution. Even community staples and renowned art museums felt the impact of the coronavirus pandemic. We were concerned, I think, very early on just with our Russell exhibition and sale and the unprecedented nature of having to delay that. Uh, first time in 52 years of that show that it was it was moved from March. That auction and sale accounts for 40% of the CM Russell Museum's yearly budget. With the event delayed until September and their doors temporarily closed, board members capitalized on available CARES Act funding to upgrade their facilities. We needed to have proper mitigation. Um, we needed to have signage. We needed to have plexiglass to protect our staff and patrons. And just to have an infrastructure available to encourage people to come in, see our galleries, explore the art, but to do so in a very safe manner. So that funding allowed us to purchase some of those items, to train staff accordingly, and to outfit our staff and volunteers with, with necessary personal protective equipment as well. The museum is once again open to visitors, but while you were away, the building got a facelift. We were able to conduct that maintenance project, remove the last little bit of asbestos we had from a past expansion decades ago, um, and just really freshen up some galleries. Um, that really is important because you can't have people around for that. So having the museum closed for a stretch provided an opportunity in that regard. As fate would have it, the museum was relatively prepared for the pandemic. We, a number of years ago, were very fortunate to have foresight from our board leadership to do two things. One is to establish a reserve fund that could see us financially through any particular challenge that could arise. The pandemic was one such challenge. And secondly, we've launched a major campaign, the largest in our museum's history, a $25 million campaign called Art and Soul, a campaign to ignite American spirit. A major component of that campaign is the establishment of an endowment. And that endowment was just underscored to us as its importance given the delay we had with the auction. The CM Russell Museum celebrates the past, but right now it's the future that people should be looking forward to. The museum plans to open six new exhibitions this October, the most they've ever opened in a single season. For Montana Cares in Great Falls, Matt Holzaffel, MTN News. Thanks, Matt. And the Russell Museum is once again open for visitors Thursday to Monday from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Stick around. A final check of your forecast is next.